So I have been failing in every kind of read one, so of course, why not try another one? <laughs> so this one that I'd like to try is the Tome Topple Readathon, it's run by Sam from Thoughts and Tomes. I really like her channel and she's done this a couple of times, but I think this is the fourth time. And I wanted to do it because I'm currently reading The Name of the Wind and I feel like I'm going to want to read The Wise Man's Fear like immediately after. And they are both big books. This is The Name of the Wind by Patrick Moffat, it's nearly 700 pages and I'm pretty sure The Wise Man's Fear is bigger. So. I want to read this, I'm currently on page 192, I'm really enjoying it. Since the Tone Topple Readathon is two weeks long, I feel like I have enough time to breathe because I feel like I can't do 24 hour readathons, I can't do <laughs> week long readathons. I quite like doing the Christmas book readathon because that's two days long. I feel like I'm going to have to do this even though it's two weeks long and my record with readathons is not ideal because <laughs> the last day of it is A Love Results Day and I kind of need something to fill up my time for the next two weeks because crippling doubt is currently filling up my time and it's not fun <laughs> so instead I want to read some good books instead <laughs> so the total read song run from the 4th of August to the 17th of August it does have challenges and there will be Instagram challenges which I think is fun not sure if I'll do any of them because again Part of the reason I fail at readathons is if there is any kind of challenge, <laughs> can't really do it. But anyway, there are five challenges and they're the same as always, and they are the first challenge is to read more than one tome, the second one is to read a graphic novel, still over 500 pages, the next one is to oh, read a tome as part of a series, can't read my own handwriting though, to buddy read a book, I don't know if I'll do that unless I find a buddy in the midst of the internet because I don't think any of my friends are going to read anything that I'm reading. <laughs> and the last one is to read an adult novel, and I'm pretty sure The Name of the Wind and Patrick... and Patrick Moffat... <laughs> the Name of the Wind and The Wise Man's Fear tick off, read more than one tome, read a tome that's part of the series, read an adult novel... I'm pretty sure it's an adult fantasy book. So, and it's part of a trilogy. So done! Yay! And I don't know whether I'll read a graphic novel, particularly one over 500 pages. If I do, it'll be Persepolis by... Can't remember. Hang on. If I do, it'll be this one. All I really know about it is kind of like Marxist, and I'm down for that. I like Marxism. <laughs> Potentially, if I want to read another to tick off the read more than one tone challenge, I might read Carry On by Rainbow Rowell because I had this on my shelf for a while, but I haven't actually read it yet. And I feel like it will be kind of light and easy for me to read, perhaps in between or maybe after the heavy load of fantasy that is. Patrick Moffat's books. <laughs> so many people know about this, you don't really need to hear me talk about it. But yeah. <laughs> I think that's everything. So yeah, thank you for watching, I hope you have a nice day, and I shall see you later. Goodbye.